make a Lego flying fight using paint shop or other stuff or other programs that you find on the internet. Okay, this is for like be like probably for beginner for beginners that don't have paint shop and they want to make a Lego fly without showing like invisible strings and stuff like that. Then it just messes it up. You click on paint and it should look like that. And then I'll exit out of that. And go to this one. See you have a background, right? Cause this background first you take a picture of a of the background you want to use. Try out of that. And then what are my pictures? going too fast. Okay. okay, so you gotta happen to do that. Yes. Just kidding. Well, anyways, I'm not getting to the new folders at all. It's taking forever. Oh my god, it's like taking forever. I know, I do weird voices all the time. Well, anyways, you might hear my same voice. This is the background, and I'll pick a picture to edit, maybe like this picture, see, oh uh, there's a clone, now you left click it, go to edit, and then it should come out like this again. Okay, what you want to do is just go to this box, this square thing. You don't want to pick on the star because the star ruins everything. Go to that. Okay, I'm trying to give you a good tutorial. Do this. Do that. You should see this Lego dude. Do that. You left click it. Well, well, I might say left click it on the on both sides and I get mixed up. So you left click it, the actual left click it, and then you do that. And then you go to copy. Shorn out of that. You go to the whoops. Wait, I'm getting mixed up. Okay. Background right here. And then you do that. And then right here you go to paste. And the picture should come out like that. A little bit weird. Little bit. What you want to do is like kind of match it up with the background. It may look hard, but it is easy for those that know how to use it. And there. As you can see, it's there on my background, nothing else, and that's how you can make Lego fly. You just get a picture of the background, and then you copy, and then you have like a picture standing on a block, and you can put your background like that. And then you can save your picture, but this is my background, I don't want to ruin a good background, so that, and then you could do that, yeah.